Fatty vitamin C for accelerating the healing process. I've been making a fatty vitamin C product for many, many years. You could find out all about it at truthtreatments.com. Omega-6 healing cream, truthtreatments.com. Anything else, Toya? Um, yes. Do you have an email address where yes. I can reach you with further questions? Absolutely. Send it to Ben, B-E-N, at K. SCO.com. Make sure you put in the subject heading Toya from Oklahoma and then make sure you put your phone number in there and I'll get back to you. Okay, Toya? Okay, you said Ben K K K S Ben at K S C O dot com. Okay? Thank you. Thank you so much for your call, Toya. God bless you. Good luck with everything. Okay, moving on to Caroline in Washington. What is up? Welcome to the bright side, Caroline. Uh, my friend has type diabetes one, type one. Type, type one, okay. Up. 50 years old. Okay. You want uh, some help with that? Yesterday. Pardon? Super, super easy. Autoimmune diseases of all kinds need to be linked to the, to the seat of immunity. Anytime you hear the word immune in your health challenge, you know you have to go to the seat of immunity, which is the digestive tract. The vast majority of the immune system and immune system cells is located in the digestive tract. So pretty much by definition, if you have an immune problem or an autoimmune problem, you have a digestive problem. There's no such thing as an autoimmune disease that does not have a component, probably causal component, that involves the digestive system. So what you do first and foremost is you gotta eliminate the attacking agents, the offending agents. Those are always gonna be foods and you gotta do a food diary to find those out. Now chances are this person knows there's certain foods they have problems with, but it always helps to write things down because things sneak, uh, sneak under the radar, especially if we've had a, a, a food intolerance to dairy all our lives or to gluten all our lives. Sometimes we just don't notice things. So writing down everything you eat and then writing down how you respond to that food Five hour, uh, four hours, six hours, eight hours, 12 hours later in terms of constipation, loose stools, diarrhea, gas, bloating, discomfort, nausea, sense of fullness, heartburn, etc., and then eliminating those foods. Step number one for dealing with type 1 diabetes or any autoimmune disease. Type 1 diabetes is, is nothing more than an, than an example of an autoimmune disease, one of the classic examples of an autoimmune disease. The second thing you're going to need to do after you do your digest, uh, food elimination, is support the digestive system using good bacteria, probiotics, fermented foods. Get on the BioLumin Nightly Essence. Use the Jordan Rubin Beyond Organic products, the Swero V and the, and the probiotic enriched cheese and the Amasai, etc. Do a, you can do a Swero V cleanse if you want to go all out. That will help reduce his symptomology. Uh, Swero V cleanse is when you do half a bottle of Swero V every hour for 12 to 24 to 36, even up to 72 hours if you want want to go all out. Make sure that uh, your friend is using the Healthy Start Pack, getting the Mighty 90 Essential Nutrients with extra sweeties after all meals, with extra selenium after all meals, 400 to 600 micrograms of selenium a, d uh, a day, and also two to three chromium and vanadium sweeties after all meals. You want to throw in a couple other things for blood sugar. It wouldn't hurt to use, uh, to use uh, uh, the amino acid taurine, maybe 1,000 milligrams a day, the amino acid arginine, anywhere from 1,000 to 2,000 milligrams a day. Magnesium is also very helpful for helping stabilize blood sugar. The B-complex is super important for blood sugar, and you'll get that in the Healthy Star Pack and the Beyond Tangy Tangerine. But personally, if it was me, I'd be using an extra 250 milligrams a day of timed release niacin, an extra 50 milligrams a day of zinc picolinate, an extra 100 to 500 milligrams a day of vitamin B1 thiamine, and then an extra 400 international units a day of vitamin E, all of which can help support uh, support diabetes. And then for all autoimmune diseases, for all health issues, it's super important to understand the oxygenate, the effect of oxygen, oxygenation, as well as the accumulation of acid and, to and uh, carbon dioxide and the accumulation of toxicity. And of course, this means slow, deep, relaxing breathing. We spent a bunch of time at the beginning of the program talking about the importance of movement and the importance of action. Well, guess what? It's just as important to make sure that the body is rested and relaxed, especially if you're dealing with an autoimmune or any immune issue. So doing your slow, deep breathing, practicing relaxation techniques, activating the so-called para 
sympathetic nervous system using hot water, baths, hot showers, hot baths, meditation, yoga, relaxation, whatever, muscle relaxation, um, uh, Reiki, anything you could do to relax the body. So you've got a threefold approach. I call that the triangle, the, tr the triangle of disease or the triangle of healing, if you will, focus on the digestive system, the blood sugar system, and relax the body. Make sure you're on the healthy star pack with all the accessory nutrients. If you want to do one more thing, Fucoid Z contains fucoidin, which can be very helpful for the immune system as well as for the blood sugar system. And thanks for your call, Carolyn. I hope we helped oh, you out. Excuse me, can I ask you a question? Yes, Hello? sure. Yes, ma'am, oh, go um, ahead. He's had steroid injections in his eyes because he's going blind. Is there anything he can do about that? And everything I just told you, Caroline, I just gave you about five minutes of everything you need to do. Steroid injections in the eyes or anything else. Every single thing I told you. If you follow even 50%, Caroline, or your friend, not you, but if your friend follows even 50% of what I just told you, he will notice not results, dramatic results. Results that are so far superior to anything the doctor can give him with steroids or anything else. He's going to be, he's going to wonder why he even goes to a doctor. Do you follow what I'm saying, Caroline? Please do not marginalize what I just said. I know it sounds, oh, well, it's just, just you know, the basics. It's just, it, there's nothing sexy about it. There's nothing really fancy schmancy about it. It's the basics. Folks, but should we don't he avoid these injections? I can't tell you that, ma'am. Oh. That's, that's between him and his doctor. But I can tell you that if he does what I just told him, he's going to notice dramatic results. And this is so important, you guys, not just for Caroline or Caroline's friends. It's for everybody. We don't need fancy schmancy medical treatments. Do we get better with our fancy schmancy medical treatments? No, never. Has any doctor ever reversed a degenerative disease with doctoring, with the medical model, with pharmacy, with surgery, with radiation? No, it doesn't happen because we don't need to be medicalized. We need just the fundamental basics, controlling digestive health or working with digestive health, using nutritional supplements to support the digestive system, stabilizing the blood sugar system, relaxing the body, making sure the body's oxygenated. I know I say this every day, multiple times a day on this program and via my presentations. It is so simple to reverse any chronic degenerative disease that it is the ultimate tragedy that anybody should have an autoimmune disease, that anybody should have a long-term chronic disease state, even though, do you know 50% of Americans are dealing with one kind of, with, with at least one chronic degenerative disease, many with two. 80% of elderly folks are dealing with one or two at least chronic degenerative diseases. 70% of Americans are on a prescription drug. And is any of it helping? No, because we got to get back to the basics. Working on the digestive system, stabilizing the blood sugar system, making sure you're nutritionally supplementing, and by all means, relaxing the body, in addition to a little bit of activity. Thank you so, so much for listening, friends. Have a spectacular, awesome, beautiful day. I'm Pharmacist Ben. We'll talk to you all later. Bye for now.